Heard 650th start and you're just as competitive as ever. Top five most of the race. How proud are you of this effort when you guys are just getting to know each other? Yeah, I can say that it wasn't anything fantastic or anything exciting, but it really was. To finish third in our second outing together and to run with, you know, the who's who of the sport, uh, it just shows Ganassi's got the right stuff. I mean, Larson had a tough break. We caught a good break to get on the lead lap with Logano and to race in the top five at the end. But, you know, all in all, for us to get gelled together, to learn what loose and tight was. But, man, I just struggled in turns three and four, and that's that's where I got arm wrestled. Uh, and they, they took us, but, hey, you know, we're top five in this kind of this kind of run. So thanks to Monster Energy. Uh, ComServe was on our car this weekend. Chip was standing right there. Uh, now thanks to Felix and Rob, our owners. Uh, it's a good third-place finish. We'll take it. Catching up at Martin Trucks Jr., second-place finish, but you're very frustrated. Why? It's just lap cars, you know. I mean, uh, it's a shame we got put in that position on that last restart, you know. Um, but that's, you know, the way the caution fell. Really proud of the team. Uh, great rebound after last weekend. Uh, Bass Pro Shops, Tracker ATVs and Boats, thank all you guys. Everybody at Toyota, uh, everybody back at the shop with JGR, they built a great race car here. And Man, I, I could taste that one. It was, uh, I, I really wanted that first Atlanta win. Just, you know, the 17 rode there in front of us forever and ever running the bottom. And I kept telling him I needed the bottom. And these cars are just so bad and dirty air that, uh, he was holding me up really bad. You know, once he, once I got around him, I, I drove, you know, got to the two car in two laps. I just needed one more. So, unfortunate we, uh, we had a great car, and uh, like I said, the guys did a great job. So, just uh, a little upset. We, we had the best car. We probably should have won that one. Thanks, Martin. What a day once again for Kyle Busch. Made it exciting. Started in the back, fought his way to the front, and then you had the issue, and you still came back to finish sixth. But what exactly did happen when you had that cut tire? Um, I got in the fence just a little bit uh, in the center of one and two, just touched it, and then uh, kind of smelt some smoke and never saw any and thought we'd be okay. But uh, overall, it just must have uh, rubbed it and cut it down. And fortunately, we got a caution there, got a, caught us a break and was able to get tires on the thing and pull it back out and go back after him. But, uh, man, what a, what a hell of a weekend for all of our guys on this uh, creamy Snickers Camry. It just was evil tight all day long. We just couldn't get the tight out of it. And uh, we were battling and running the wall all day long, and that's where I needed to be in order to make up any time. And um, doing that, you, you run close to the fence and you run into opportunities to get yourself in trouble. But overall, um, salvaged a decent day, I guess. And, um, you know, we can move on out of here with some positives.